You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week. Let's continue trying out the games included in the Mega Drive Mini. And um, more or less I've played all the games that uh, I, I have tried before at, in, at one point or another, but uh, let's see about uh, the ones that I have never tried, such as this one. Value games in a can. No idea what this is. And let's see. Alright, seems like it's completely in Japanese. Oh, this is a game that was exclusive to the Sega channel, since it says there. Alright, okay. So it seems like a mini game compilation. Hey, this looks familiar, isn't this? Sega Master System game. Uh, that's also from an arcade game. Uh, completely in Japanese. Oh no, this is different. I have no idea what this is. And since I couldn't understand the rules, no idea what you're supposed to do here. I okay. cannot even seem to... Oh, there! I got my... Ugh, come on! Fly up a bit there! Kill me. All right, I got it, but I couldn't say it's actually fun. <laughs> it's more like frustrating with its controls. Um, it's okay, I guess. It's just I don't think this thing has aged well. Oh, okay. Um, what's he saying? Didn't I get the key? Are there two keys, I guess? Alright, if this thing asks for a third key, I'm gonna change this game. Oh, come on. Alright, sorry. Oh, maybe I could try the other games in this collection. Return. Game reset. Here we go. I saw that there were a lot of mini games. Okay. What about this one? This looks like a side scroller. Teddy Boy Blue. Master System Graphics. Okay. Alright. Some sort of puzzle platformer. Run and gun. This should be good. If I could just figure out what to actually do. Okay. Am I supposed to just kill everyone? Is there significance to that alarm clock? Just break all 
all the ice? Somebody tell me what to do. <laughs> I have no clue. Kill everyone. Maybe eventually. I'm gonna get someone. What the? All of a sudden, it's clear bonus. Which makes me hope. Anything with bogus. Suddenly clear bonus, I, had, I didn't do anything specific. Anyway, enough of that. Let's try the other games included in this. Alright, so I'm gonna spend the rest of the video trying out these games included on, uh, on this game. Action Robot Battler, okay. Sounds like a title that I'd buy on its own. Okay, so we could allocate some stats here, I would guess. And since I have no idea what they are, I'll just keep things balanced. I have no idea what these all are. Okay, okay. Yes, yes. Let me just play already. Reminds me of that old Atari game, is it uh, Combat? Where you drive around tanks or something. And the arena looks something like this. Of course this has uh, like a better graphics and all. It's out to get me. It's doing melee attacks. So it's like an overhead uh, deathmatch. <laughs> I don't want to go over that menu again because <laughs> I really don't understand it. But anyway, if you're all curious on what's included, let's go ahead and try it for you. There's something called what it puzzle. Just 
So it looks like these games were released... Um, one after another. Ah! How would I know? It would crack or not. Let's try it here. Okay. And so they compiled all these games. I think it's in the Sega channel. So they compiled all these games into one cartridge, maybe. I don't know. If it's one cartridge. Or maybe this just here on this uh, mini collection. I'm not sure if there's an actual cartridge on this, like I said. Okay, this one is um, simple fun. Uh, okay. Not sure I'm... I guess I'm doing it right, but why does it look like he dies every time you bring the egg to her? Air hockey. Paddle fighter. Okay. So I guess that's you, Bin Bowie. And you're going up against you, Masler. Yep, air hockey. like I have some special ability there. I was able to bring up some shield on my goal. Alright! You know, this would actually be cool if there's actually a two-player versus mode. But, um, well, I didn't really check if there was, though. Games like these are best when it's two-player, of course. Alright, 2-0. Let's go ahead. Let's finish it off. <laughs> you can't seem to reach it, and it just feels like it's going on forever. Alright. Score is tied. And... okay. Hey, what happened? Why did it move? <laughs> it moved by itself. Fighting myself. Come on! Uh, let's move on. Don't want to spend too much time on that. Even though I'm frustrated. Table Metal City. Okay. Mighty Icon, it looks like a card game. Let's see how this one goes. Metal City. Okay, 
way? Did I choose slots or something? to be some casino game and I'm not oh there okay hmm times like these I wish I was playing as a setzer instead from Final Fantasy 3 or 6 depending where you're playing it oh okay I guess you could exit anytime This one, I presume, is poker. I'm betting everything. Okay, let's just do it. Obviously not my thing. <laughs> yeah, I don't really play at uh, casinos that much. Role playing. Let's see how this one goes. This should be just a simple game. Ooh. Fatal Labyrinth. Okay. Alright, we got here an overhead game with them. I am sleepy, I am parent, I've been damaged. Well, at least it's in English. I don't have the patience to learn games like this. Okay, I'll just try to survive as long as I can and see if something interesting might happen. Having a fog of war is a good idea. Uh, it's like a dead end. scheme. So I was able to swing the axe by pressing the direction button on the enemy. 
so there is no like attack button you just have to push forward on the enemy there which is weird I haven't played anything like that before let's try that again yeah let's destroy the jelly It's been going through every opponent I've faced with little effort. Die, die, die. I'm not sure if I'm actually swinging or if I'm stuck. Harry, awaken. Oh, I, I was asleep, probably. Wait, did I actually make it? Oh no. <laughs> I had to ask. Alright, let's see what's next. There's four more games to go. Action Hyper Marble. When you load the game, it gives you a different title. Hyper Marbles. Oh, look, we're just playing. Too bad there's only just one player right now, just me. Uh, I'm not sure which one. Oh, I'm the blue thing. Okay. And I'm supposed to. I guess I'm supposed to kill the other things. Those yellow things. And the blue one. With bouncy controls. Okay. Pretty straightforward there. Yeah, this should be fun when it's versus, I guess. Oh, look, there's someone my own size now. <laughs> ah, rematch. All right. Oh yeah. Oh. Even worse. So pressing the buttons give me some sort of a uh, small boost there, but it works against my advantage because I bounce off and head straight to that electricity. And that was f fast and fun. Sports putter golf. I guess the first word is the genre, and then the name of the game. Okay. Controls, which I don't understand. Yeesh. <laughs> gonna go on forever? Oh, it disappeared. How nice. Yeah! So it's basically... What do you call it? Like a mini golf. Complete with obstacles. Weird. Obstacles. Like I never left. <laughs> All right. Let's see, I'm, I'm no golf player. Not even Mario Golf. There, I said it. <laughs> like I 
never left. Apparently, I can't go there. What? I am so sorry. <laughs> I'm just not having fun with that one. No fault of the game, I suppose. It might be because I'm just not really into golf. All right, next action, Flicky. So I suppose Flicky is the character. Tiger, Chirp, and Iggy, okay. Help guide to the door. Press button to jump and shoot, okay. Interesting. All right. Okay, this is actually interesting. It's so um, old school. <laughs> you know, like classic. Uh, Classic uh, arcade or Famicom games. Oh look, they're all st still there. I could just reach them before. Alright, send for the exit! No, no, no. Ah. This is harder than it looks. Oh, okay, I could throw these things. That should make things doable. Alright, almost there. Alright. This, uh, the, um, Sega Mega Drive Mini here is really more than just 42 games. As I said already, it's because of the Mega Man collection. And this one, if you count them all, this is 16 games, so that's, uh, um, 45 plus, uh, 16 or 15, because we're gonna count the value games in the can. So yeah, that's a lot of game. This is really worth Alright, I think we're down to the last. Yep. Action 16 tons. I don't know what this is all about. But uh, it looks cool. Okay. Hope I can play it. Alright. So I look like a huge lemming guy with red scan lines. Probably from prison. I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do though. Am I supposed to just go all the way down and down and down? Oh. See, it brings me back up, so maybe I'm supposed to go all the way down. I'm supposed to kill these guys with my 16-ton 
anything. Boom. Unfortunately, I didn't understand this game enough. Boom. Huh. Oh, so it does refill. I just wait a bit. So maybe I'm supposed to kill these guys. Hey, nice. You can actually control your jump. Boom. can actually also kill yourself when you try to... But the enemy seems to be respawning, so I don't know, how do you... They did mention this is still round one, so how do you get to round two or something? zero Ooh. and they just respawn like normal. How do you advance? Ooh. Okay, it seems to be going in a loop when I go down and down you encounter the same guys again that you left up there. I don't know, I have to look it up how to actually play these games. But yeah, this is Value Games in a Can. I think that should be it for this video. I've tried all the available Ooh. games here. And uh, some are interesting. Some are actually Ooh. fun. Uh, but some I just guess I don't have the patience for. It's all worth a try, so at least once this, um, I presume this is kind of a, a rarity because it was originally only available on the Sega channel from what I understand and now it's here for our convenience. Anyway, thanks for sticking to the end. You're watching 8-bit days a week. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And um, we'll try the other game soon. I think we're al I'm almost done, though. Please like, comment, subscribe.